Hey everyone, Aaron here with Happy Hydro. This is our first video, so we're just gonna do a quick rip on the ROI E680 from Grower's Choice. Let's go check it out. All right, in this video, I'm just gonna take some time to kind of go through what you can expect when working with the ROI E680 and what it's like to get a shipment from us here at Happy Hydro. All of our packages come out of our Buffalo, New York warehouse and are shipped directly to you. We do practice discrete shipping methods and all of our packages are insured just to give you that extra little peace of mind. When you open your box, you can expect to find an owner's manual, a nicely packed light, and an even smaller box. Inside this box is every accessory you need to get this light up and running. It includes four ratcheting straps to help you mount the light, a 120 volt twist lock plug, and a 240 volt adapter. The ROI E680 has a dimension size of 42.4 by 42 by 2.4 inches and weighs just around 30 pounds. It is a high performance LED bar style light and has an input power of 680 watts, a 1700 micromole per second total output and a 2.6 micromole per joule system efficacy. A nice feature is that it has a built-in dimmer switch, which allows you to toggle between a couple different settings. This helps you take this light and use it from veg to bloom. Grower's Choice ROI E680 is made with top bin Osram diodes, paired with its flagship 3K CMH full phase spectrum. This light is the real deal. We found that this light works best in a 4x4 four four to 5x5 five five foot area coverage. We also did a little par reading of our own using an Apogee MQ620. This instrument is important because it allows for a wider range of spectrum to be measured. And at 12 inches in height, starting in the middle of the light, we found a reading of about 1500. On the outside of the tent, we found that reading to be about 1180. And all the way in the corner, we see that to be about 650 micromoles per second. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Like I said, this is our first episode ever on the Happy Hydro YouTube channel. So please comment down below anything that you think we could do better or any upcoming episodes you'd like to see. Until then, like this video, subscribe to the channel for updates. Don't forget to check back next week for the next episode in the series. And until then, stay happy, friends.